everyone. Today we'll show you an apartment in Singapore. I'm standing here outside one of the apartment in Little India. So come, let's go. Here is the gated security. Just as my dad might be, it opens the door for me. there is another level of security I need to first enter the code and then only I can go inside so let's go so the house that we are showing you today is a two-bedroom fully furnished house with all the essential amenities but just as we enter there is a modular kitchen so let's explore the kitchen first This kitchen may not look very spacious but uh, it has uh, ample of storage space with a lot of cabinets and there is a microwave also. There is a uh, induction with the chimney installed. Moving ahead, just in case you are wondering that this is also a cabinet, well no, this is a refrigerator and at the bottom itself there is a freezer also. And in this kitchen, there is a washing machine. This washing machine has inbuilt dryer. Next, connected with the kitchen is the living area. So let's check it out. So all the furniture that you see here is provided by the landlord. This sofa is actually a sofa cum bed which is pretty useful if there are some extra people joining in the house. Here at the end of the hall there is a full length glass wall. This gives a spectacular view to the room. Now let's go to the master bedroom. This room looks spacious. It has concealed lights on the ceiling. At one side of the room, I see the full length glass wall, same as the living area. This makes the room look modern. Once curtains are opened, it is as good as a balcony. This room has an attached bathroom and all the fixtures here are quite decent. There are full length cupboards in the room, so basically ample of storage space. This is the bomb shelter. So just in case the city ever gets bombed, this room is used to shield the occupants. Otherwise, it's used as a storeroom by tenants. Next, the living area has a common bathroom. This is mainly used by occupants of the common bedroom. Okay, let's go to the common bedroom now. This looks like a cozy room, much smaller than the master bedroom. Even the cupboard here is just a single door full length cupboard. So that was the complete tour of the flat. Giving you an approximate idea, monthly rent of flat in this building is 2500 to 2800 Singapore dollars. I'm sure this virtual visit to Singapore apartment in addition to the complete rental series will definitely make it much simple for you to plan your stay in a rented property in Singapore. Please like the video, subscribe the channel. Thanks for watching.